Hi guys, Rise Geek here with some more Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone on PS1. Last time we got the password for the first portrait from Fred and George, now we're getting well the done. second one. You've got enough blue every flavour beans. Mmm, blueberry pie, my favourite. Thanks, Harry. The password for the ground's portrait is Cat Weasel. Watch out for Snape, Harry. He shows up when you'd least expect him. And it did turn out I was wrong, so I, I thought that you just got um, more cards from uh, the, um, you know, the portraits with the passwords. But it turns out you actually get uh, these, um, like, better items. We got a better broom in the last one. Um, I'm not sure what we're going to get for this one. Where's the portrait then? <coughs> I thought it was in here somewhere. Must be wrong. Well, we'll keep looking, but then where else it could be? Puff games. We looked in here, didn't we? Yeah, I can't go in there now, so. I'm guessing we've already been in there, that means. But I wouldn't have thought a portrait would be out here in the woods. Did we find it over here before? Yeah, I remember now. Here we are. Cat Weasel. Well done, young Gryffindor. That is indeed the correct password. Oh, I guess I'll have to open up for you now. <laughs> so, uh, this time we just get a card. But I think it's Albus Dumbledore in this one. Albus Dumbledore. And now we've got to go back to the dungeons to get the thing in there. I'm not even sure we found the portrait in there. I don't think we did. And then we have to get red beans. We haven't even seen any yet, so... I really don't know what area um, the red beans are going to be for. Maybe it's the one we're heading towards, the Transfiguration class area. Mm. You know... I could cut this out for, for you lot, but I think it's not going to take too long to get there, so. That camera really hates being by walls, doesn't it? We've nearly got all the cards as well, actually, thinking about it. We're only like five off. to the dungeons. Um, yeah. Was it this one to the dungeons? Yeah. See, I'm learning this slowly.
And where were Fred and George in here though? Okay, so this is it says to portrait rooms, I'm guessing. Well there they are as well. So where's the portrait? Oh, it's right there. Hey Harry, have you got those green every flavour beans? Ha, huh, nice work. The password for the portrait is Wangle. Now that sounds dirty. Very, very dirty. Wanglewort. Well done, young man. You've got the password. At least in here you'll be safe. That sounds kind of creepy. It's a pervy painting. And this time we have... Oh, the, no, it's not... Oh, I, I remember this actually, yeah, they're, they're armbands for like when you play Quidditch, so they uh... Quidditch armour. Because we have two more matches to play at Quidditch throughout the game. I think Ravenclaw's next, and then it'll be Slytherin for the final one. Right, so now that we've caught up with that, it's uh, off to Transfiguration class for the final spell. I think. Yep, one spell left to get, one set of that to get, and five cards. Why isn't the card like glowing on the left. Do we have to get all cards for that? Oh, maybe, I don't know. But... I don't know. So, let's head to Transfiguration class. I'm trying to think like, in terms of the story of, the, of this um, book and film, what there is left to do, because so far it's not really followed the story. I know we have to go to... Um, we get in trouble when we go to the Forbidden Forest at one point. Um, it's been ages since I read the first book and ages since I watched the film, so I'm not too sure. Where we had to go? No. I don't think so. Unless it's up here. That's oh, Charmed Class. Damn it. I don't use this camera, it's making me feel very sick. Okay, so I'm guessing it's the uh, door up here then. Great foyer, probably not that. Yeah, I remember him saying it was the upper castle, so. Here we go then. No, this looks familiar. And ah, uh, here they are, so. F 
forbidden corridor is there. Girls' toilets is locked. And that's the transfiguration class. Come to sample the rare delights of the upper castle, eh? Just watch out for Filch and his cat, Mrs. Norris. Anyway, we'll trade the portrait password for, oh, say, red every flavour beans? Chilli powder flavour. Hot as blazes. Okay, so this is the final. So it wasn't here. And some beans. Jump at time. Oh, that was close. Join us, Harry. We're about to start the transfiguration lesson. Can't make a mind up what accent they've given her in this. It's doing my head in since we had it earlier. Transfiguration is the most complex and dangerous magic you'll learn at Hogwarts. Anyone messing around in my class will leave and not come back. You have been warned. There's really Watch my wand move around the screen oh, here we go again. and press the symbol button it points to. Complete each sequence three times to learn the transfiguration spell Aviforz. Get ready. That was good. Excellent. <laughs> Perfect. Good. Now try and keep up. That was good. Excellent. This is really easy. <laughs> Perfect. I get the feeling that we've got to have to use like each spell again towards the end, and the incendio really one well. might Let's kill keep me. Going. That was good. Now let's put the spell into practice. Harry Potter, follow me, please. Please don't be a reaction thing again. <clears throat> Welcome, Harry. First use your wand to cast a transfiguration spell on the statue. Now hit your symbol button at the right time in order to transfigure the oh, statue into its God, new shape. No. Let's see if you can transform this statue, and perhaps you'll find a way to reach the doorway at the top of the room. <laughs> Abby Fords! I don't know how I did that, but okay. Well done, Mr. Potter. Five points to Gryffindor. Now use the floating table to leave the <coughs> Okay, guys, I've been Rosie Geek, and I've been playing Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Star on PS1. Don't forget to like, share, and favourite, and of course, subscribe down below. And I'll see you next time for some more Harry Potter. Till then, see you later.